So, uh, for this video, we're not gonna talk about the good, the bad, and the ugly, but we'll do a comparison for uh, this two, the LP40, the Lenovo LP40, and the Lenovo LP40 Pro. Okay, welcome back, you guys. <laughs> Since I already have this one, and I have this one, the LP40 and the LP40 Pro, why not do a comparison, right, for the views? <laughs> okay, so first one, this is the Lenovo LP40. Uh, you've seen my video. If not, uh, you can search it, Lenovo LP40. So this is the LP40, and this is the LP40 Pro, the black one. Okay, first off, uh, the difference would be the branding. Okay, you could see the the Lenovo in the LP40, the first one. Is it too bright? The white one is uh, getting all the reflection or, or the light. The LP40 Pro has Think Plus in front. So that's the first difference that you'll notice uh, in their charging case. And the LP40 Pro has the Lenovo branding at the back. But the LP40 only has a button you could you could press it it lights up green if it's charging charging case almost looks identical but this one the lp40 looks like a capsule on the side and the lp40 pro this this part is a little bit hold on let me let me hold both hands it might fall off again <laughs> this as you can see here if you could see if you could notice uh, the cap part looks and is a lot, oh no, a little bigger than the bottom part. Okay, so it's gradually in increasing in uh, diameter, in size, okay? Okay, so here's the cap side and here's the bottom side. It's smaller. Here they are in comparison with each other. Side, uh, top, you could see it. Okay front and back yeah okay okay well, let me tell you that this doesn't look good by the looks of it when uh, there are when you can see spikes testing microphone recording when you see spikes like those in uh, the waveform, it doesn't look good. It has to be, uh, has to be a, a fair amount. Maybe in the middle, middle ground, middle, just like here. Not, not really hitting those. But I think it looks better than than the LP40 Pro. So let's let's see. Okay, you can hear it. You can hear it like that. Okay. Okay, you're hearing the audio purely from the LP40 Pro. Okay, uh, uh, a motorcycle or I think a tricycle just went by. Uh, you, I can see the, the, the audio waveform spikes in this, uh, through this recording. Okay, so it's recording to the LP40 Pro, Lenovo LP40 Pro. Now, with the physical aspects, physical difference, you'll notice right away that the LP40, here it is, looks like the traditional AirPods. Okay, it has the uh, dent on the stem. But the LP40 Pro, Lenovo LP40 Pro, has this rubber thingy, as I've said on my past video about this. And it has an LED light that blinks when in use or when it's ready to be paired and it has no dent in the stem you could tap it here for controls the almost non shiny part actually yeah it's the only non shiny part because it's where you tap that one okay you tap you tap it here here this area while this one you could uh, pinch okay side by side <laughs> i really like my lens this lens is so cool when it comes to sound quality uh, i think the pro is better a little bit better i rank this maybe 6 or 6.5 and this is i think 8 it's because i noticed more detail coming 
from this one but even though the the sound quality is better with this one this makes up for other things for example this one it has very sensitive touch areas the the one that you tap for controls if this one is really sensitive this one is it's double or triple the sensitivity and it's not good for me it's not good uh, there are some unintended controls that are happening when you're using it okay so this one it's yeah it's sensitive i don't like it as well the sensitivity not the ear earbuds itself but the sensitivity but when comparing these two i would rather use this because it lets me uh, enjoy music more I have to uh, be mindful of my sleeping position and my head tilt when using this one, the LP40 Pro. Okay, another difference between these two, I think it's the battery life. I've experienced much longer usage for the LP40 Pro. To be fair, I try to use them both the same, I think, the duration of my usage. I've charged this about four or five times in a month, but this one I only charged for, I think, twice. That's a significant difference. But also to be fair with the LP40, uh, this is older. <laughs> so there might be some uh, some deteriorating factors because this is older. If ever uh, you have just enough money to buy one, which one would I recommend you to buy? So uh, here's a tough one actually. I don't like the general build quality of the LP40 Pro. And I have nothing against this little dude, the LP40. I don't like the design of this. I don't like that it's shiny. I don't like uh, the plastic that they've used. I have no complaints here. But <laughs> I, I, you see, you see what I mean? This is so hard for me. The sound quality of this for its price, nothing compares actually. For earbuds below a thousand pesos, this has the best sound quality out there for that price range and i couldn't uh, let that slip i mean it's a big thing for me so in conclusion if you're like me and sound matters the most overall over everything else the build quality the battery the price everything else if sound matters most you get the lp40 pro but other than that i mean the the sound of the lp40 is not that bad really it's good it's just that the lp40 pros is better aside from that best overall is this one lp40 so for me if i only have budget for one of these i'll, I'll pick the lp40 pro if you want to buy it if you want to check it out the links are in the description below let me know in the comments what you think for me they're both good but this this one is uh, the sound of this one is better okay so i'll see you around peace out